In this video lecture, I am going to find the remainder and the cosine of a given polynomial 6x cube plus 13x square plus 3 divided by 3x plus 2. So let's see the answer. So first you are writing 3x plus 2. Next is 6x cube 13x square plus 3. So here next two is write 3x and uh, 3x plus 2 and here equal to 6x cube. So what number should be multiply then or uh, there 6x cube that come. So obviously add here we need to multiply 2x square. So 2 into 3 6 and x into x square 6 x cube so writing here 2x square then here this is 6 x cube and here this 4 x square so we can try it this place 6 x cube 4 x square now subtract so this cancel 13x square minus 4x square 9x square and after that write here 3 the next is 3x plus 2 and we need to get 9x square so if I multiply here with 3x so it equal to 3 into 3 9x square and 3 into 2 6x okay so we can write here 3x then it come 3 into 3 9x square and 3 into 2 6x after that subtract this cancel now we can write minus 6x plus 3 now the next is 3x plus 2 and there we need to get minus 6x so if i multiply there with minus 2 then that come minus 6x so writing here minus 2 so this here minus 6x and minus 2 into 2 that is minus 4 so this minus minus that change to plus plus so this opposite sign and 4 plus 3 that is 7 now this is the cosine and this here remainder is 7 so this is the remainder so this is the first way we can achieve cosine and remainder let's see another way so for another way writing go here px 6 x cube plus 13 x square plus 3 and gx 3 x plus 2 for remainder theorem gx equal to 0 so that 3 x plus 2 equal to 0 now x equal to minus 2 by 3 so 2 move on the right minus 2 and thereafter 3 move on the denominator minus 2 by 3 now here px is 6 x cube plus 13 x square plus 3 so for remainder theorem px divided by gx and gx is 3x plus 2 so that remainder is p minus 2 by 3 so putting the x value so 6 minus 2 by 3 power q 13 minus 2 by 3 power square plus 3 so 6 minus 2 so this here minus 8 by 27 
this here 13 4 by 9 and this here 3 now the next is this here minus 48 by 27 and this here 52 by 9 and this here 3 so 3 times 8 cancel 16 and this here 9 after that we can write minus 16 by 9 plus 52 by 9 plus 3 now here 9 52 minus 16 6 4 minus 1 that is 3 minus 36 plus 3 it cancel so this here pos big is 52 so that this is the positive sign it cancel by 4 times and here that come 4 plus 3 and here 7 so p minus 2 by 3 the value come 7 so this is the remainder so we can write here remainder is 7 if that ask about only to calculate remainders you can use this way or if you want then you can use previous way so this is the way we can find the remainder and the quotient of this given polynomial. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.